Hi, good evening. I haven't made a video in a while, and here's a video. I have just, I don't know, I've just been busy. But, um, yeah, I don't know, I, I need a break, okay? I need a break, like, I need a break. People are peopling, people are, like, not peopling, but, like, I don't fucking know. I, I don't, I don't know. Because I've been on the internet too much, and people in real life are just peopling. And I know I'm a person, and I have people too, but damn. Like, like damn. You know? I'm not crazy, so like... Anyways. Um, but, yeah, so I, uh, I'm gonna make some more videos whenever. I've just been dancing a lot, and I've kind of got on my dancing schedule, which has been really interesting, and I've been having this entire crisis about, like, am I a dancer now? And is that, which is not necessarily a bad thing, it's just that, I, I, you know, it's just something that's intimidating, because, like, I had to explain to people, like, I'm not, like, it's like the gangster thing, but different. Like, I'm not a gangster, I'm just a black guy in a do-rag. But, like, like there's, there's no insult to people who are gangsters because, like, good for you, slay. But, like, it's also lame to, like, claim to be something that you're not. So, like, anyways, um, so, like, when it comes to the dancer thing, I'm like, well, I'm just, like, a K-pop stan. So, I'm, like, a guy who just happens to dance because I'm a K-pop stan. And it's just, like, a part of being a K-pop stan. But, like, it's I'm held to the standards of a dancer. It's just like like low key interesting, and I feel like that's uh, it's not necessarily a problem. It's just and just I guess I gotta get used to, and maybe appreciate the amount of the tension that that standard would bring. But that means I need to take dance classes because I can admit I do need dance classes, and it's been like a part of my planning for a while. But I haven't been able to get a job with like a consistent schedule. Like, I think I do now, so I could probably possibly manage that or whatever. And I think that'll be really nice because, like, I have been, like, getting my content schedule organized, or at least, like, getting consistently, like, outputting certain content and getting, like, understanding what themes that I want so I can, like, craft them a little bit better moving forward. Or just, like, when, like, I get other things together to develop those pro like, those projects, like, those ideas into legitimate projects, like, the Leander Pop t-shirt that I'm, that I've been promoting, and, like, the online business, having a side store that has my personal flair put into it, and, um, styles, like, representative of my online brand, um, and that's sort of, like, why I've been playing around with different color schemes and seeing the vibes, and sort of, like, like, yeah, anybody can put on a do-rag, but, like, who's doing it first? Not, like, putting on a do-rag, but, like, using it as part of an aesthetic with the stars and the blah. Like, I can sit here and be humble all day because, like, industry stuff. But, like, we're not going to just pretend that, like, me being a basic bitch didn't start a whole trend. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate that it's recognized and that it's, and that it's like, you know, a little nod. But like, I'm not just going to sit here and like, just pretend, like just hold back on saying stuff or pretend that I'm nothing just because of like some internet street cred or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like the online like noise sometimes. I guess I know it's part of it. And it's, it's like, whatever. But I'm just kind of like, okay. Like, yeah, I am boring. But, like, I'm effective when I, when applied correctly. So, anyways. Um, yeah, so I think I was like, look, I think that was a decent video. I just kind of had to get my stars together. Because I, I never wear the silver do-rag. So, I never really know what to do with the silver do-rag. But, um, yeah. Also, I need to make a video because I was starting to be moody. Like, technically, everything is going fine for me, technically. I mean, like, yeah, 
I have been like, I like recent, like 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 there's like I I have I've had like some personal stuff, but like that's fine. It's fine. I think it's like waved the waved waved over a little bit. I don't know, but like. Like, I'm fine. So I just need to get productive and started making content. But I didn't feel like exhausting myself doing dances that I know wouldn't stick. And I don't know what it was with the sudden wave of like sort of pseudo subtle homophobia when it comes to certain online content. Like forcing heterosexual content on like, at least on my page. And on like, it seems like it's being forced on other people's pages when they have a clear uh, preference and orientation. And I'm noticing it socially as well, sort of forcing heterosexual sexual conversation, but getting just offended at the slightest hint of gayness, which is like really annoying that we're getting back into our homophobia area era, which is really funny because I'm noticing other people of different ethnicities complaining about an increase of racism as well. I get it that we're not in our social justice era anymore per se. But, like, I don't know. I thought us being problematic was going to go into, like, being problematic for funsies. Not being problematic as in, let me leverage, like, like, ironclad phobias and, um, what is the word? Prejudices against you for whatever social or petty reasons. <sighs> But, like, I don't know. Unfortunately, I seem to be right about the things I don't want to be right about. So, yeah. Anyways. Uh, that's my little blurb for the evening. Might get another blurb. If I feel like it. 